All right, this might be a good time during the bye week to air it out on the Chiefs. I've been called a downer, a negator, and some other stuff I can't really say in this space, and I understand. I dish it out, but I'm just trying to be honest here, folks. It's wonderful for the city that the Chiefs are 9-0, and oh, but I do think it's time to accept the fact the Chiefs are not an elite team. This is not a pretty team to watch. That doesn't mean they're not good. It's not a team you envision being undefeated after nine games. The competition is about to change dramatically. There will be no more backup quarterbacks to wreak havoc on. Seven of the Chiefs' nine victories are against teams with losing records right now. There is only one of those left on the schedule. This team is not built for a deep run into the playoffs. What's happened this year is pure gravy already. Very few even predicted the Chiefs would win nine games all year. And if you are honest with yourself, folks, now, you don't really believe the Chiefs are better than Denver, do you? That doesn't mean the Chiefs can't beat them. The Chiefs have to show us they're capable of scoring touchdowns in the red zone instead of kicking field goals. This offense is going to be a real issue at playoff time. It is what it is. It's unbelievable the Chiefs are 9-0 and with this offense. Crunch time is upon us. Seven to play. I have revised my prediction now in the second half, a 3-4 finish. Twelve victories. Terrific accomplishment. No one, I mean no one, saw that coming this season. That's Jack Smack.